Hi guys! Welcome back. Thanks for tuning in. Ah, I don't really like that intro. I kind of want something different. So if you guys have any suggestions, please comment below. I'd love to hear them. Today is going to be kind of a barn vlog. Um, my farrier's coming, so we're going to do, I think, fronts on all four of the horses. One of them was in a full set, but it seemed to kind of throw her off a little bit in the hind. We were doing some corrective shoeing. So I think I'm just going to have her go into a front set by Mare Magic because she's doing so well with her training. Yay! I want to put her in a set of front shoes because I'm going to be taking her for trail rides more this summer. And then uh, we'll probably work in the hayloft some and then I hope to ride both Rose and Magic. It's not supposed to be super hot temperature wise but it's pretty humid out here. My glasses are already fogging and I have all I've done is bring them in and feed them. Hey guys! Wait, she, my horse is my horse is drinking. Let me go grab her. Ma, 
Magic has made absolute leaps and bounds, not only with her training, but we've also kind of discovered what was going on with her. She is gluten intolerant. So we have put her on a completely gluten-free diet and she is a different horse. So today is gonna be my first day really riding her in the ring since my last video I put up. I've taken her on one or two trail rides. Back up. Um, and she's been really, really good. So today I'm just gonna play with her in the ring and you guys will get to see what we've been working on. So, nice and red in the face. Um, okay, so the farrier's done, everybody got fronts. Uh, road magic, she did really good. Not as good for me as for my trainer, but work in project, <laughs> work in progress. Um, I decided not to ride Rose. I forgot she's being ridden tonight, so figured she seemed a little sore with the farrier, so I only want her being ridden once today. So now I'm in the hayloft, and I'll give you a little tour. Um, gotta pick up baling twine that's been thrown on the ground and throw that in a trash bag, move some bales of hay, get an idea of how much hay I have left before I order more. So this is our hayloft. <clears throat> so, whew. It's a little dark because some of the lights up in the rafters have burned out and I don't like spiders so I don't go up there. So this is the staircase up from downstairs and then you enter the hayloft. So I think you've seen in other videos but each horse has a manger that we toss the hay down which is kind of nice. So let's see, oh I see magic. So you can see I'm starting to run low. I think we can fit about 400 bales up here. So I guess we have maybe 100 left would be my guess. Here's a staircase up to the cupola, which is on top of the barn. And let me see if I can. Ooh. It's full of spider webs, so I need to de-spider web. Um, so then here are the other two mangers. I see that fire. <laughs> and then this door is normally closed, but I have it open ah, today 
because what I'm going to do is I'm going to brush all the loose hay out the door and down onto the tarp, which I will then somehow attach to the tractor and drag out to the field. So there we go. That's what I'm going to be working on. So yeah, you can see all this hay. Um, what I do first, I got to pick up all of these strings and throw them in a trash bag. Oh, this half already need hay. So I'm going to pick up all the, the twine first, then I'll start pushing probably all of this I will push out first, and then I'll work my way from the front out. So that's what we're going to do. can't tell very well, but here's the finished product. I got all the hay stacked along that. You can see all the hay from the ground is gone. Whew.
So as you can see, got all of that stuff out. I'm really glad. Now have probably a month or so before we'll need to order hay. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, like, and if you haven't done so, please subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching. Hello, princess. Hello. We're so pretty good. Grandma!